You heard it here. Over 600 signatures supporting no short-term rentals in residential single-family zones in Lafayette. Last week, the council approved a piece of property to be rezoned in such an area for the purpose of a short-term rental. The person who got the signatures tells News 10's Renee Allen rezoning should not be an option. The signatures were collected during the council meeting where the property's owner's request to have her property rezoned was approved. Stephanie Cornet was at that Lafayette City Council meeting collecting signatures against such rezoning. Developers and uh, property owners in Lafayette have their property and it can be changed at any time at for anything. Cornet speaks to us today but shared her thoughts before the council last week when that vote was in play. Is basically taking an RS uh, neighborhood and spot zoning property into a different zone and I, I really feel like that is the death knell of planning and zoning. Councilman Boudreaux explained the research and work was done to ensure the property will be an asset as opposed to a problem. Cornet tells News 10 she got the signatures saying no more such rezoning and now the council will have those signatures too. I do not support spot zoning. I believe that that is a poor way to develop a city and unreliable. New City Councilman Thomas Hooks did not keep quiet either on the issue. Good policy tool. Um, this does not feel like it in terms of rezoning individual lots for particular uses. And so I think, you know, we will see more of these. I think we'll need a better answer than the rezoning process. Also, Councilman Hooks spoke with News 10 about his council statement. Prior council banned short-term rentals. I think folks knew there would be some unintended consequences, and I think that is what we are preparing to see with the rezoning process. And April 1st is when short-term rental owners must be licensed to operate. Randy Allen reporting for Kelly News 10.